UGC on Roblox is about to change forever. What is going on, everyone? It's your boy, Bobby Blocks, checking in. Now, if you guys don't know, Roblox RTC on Twitter tweeted out. I'm going to read it for you guys right now. Roblox RTC on Twitter tweeted out that UGC limited items are coming very soon. Every UGC creator can only upload one per day, excluding star creators. So I'm guessing star creators can upload maybe as many as they want, or who really knows? Fees are associated, and most metadata can't be changed once uploaded. Here's why some people believe this will crash the Roblox limited market is, if you guys don't know what the Roblox limited market is, on Roblox there's an avatar shop and some items are limited. It'll tell you on the bottom left corner of the item if it's limited or not. Things like the Dominus, obviously if you don't know what the Dominus is, it's one of the most like hyped up or rare or exclusive items on Roblox. They are worth millions of Robux, some of them going up to 999 million Robux. So RTC is going to give us the top three reasons why they think this is kind of bad for Roblox. Number one is the exclusivity. Some traders believe that because so many will be uploaded, it will ruin the exclusivity and supply and demand markets. Just like I said, the Dominus limited markets, they are so limited that that's why they go up in value. Just like anything else. It's like, it's just like having a cool pair of sneakers. You know what I'm saying? Uh, these things are worth a lot of money because there was only X amount made and that's why they go for so much. It's literally supply and demand. Because these limiteds will have so many to go around, some creators believe that the limited economy will crash. Honestly, I think the same thing. I think it's going to crash. The number two reason is the copies. Now, copies are expected to be on the limited market because Roblox created limiteds. This means many UGC creators are expected to make limited copies of old valuable Roblox items, further deflating the value. That's true. Why wouldn't you, if you're able to upload your own for cheaper than what it's going for, why wouldn't you do that? These people will buy the copy because it's less than the one that it's the real limited. Like, this is crazy, man. This is crazy. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of want to start making Roblox UGC. Why not? You know what I'm saying? If, if, if you if this is real, why not? You can make some Robux, get some sales in, cash it out on DevX, and make some money. I'm sure that's what these people are gonna be doing. And number three, the third reason is the copyrighted material. Now, the UGC market is already flooded with copywritten items. Items. So who says more won't be uploaded as UGC limiteds? UGC limited market may be filled with copyright items, further decreasing the credibility of the program. I agree. I agree with that. I mean, who's to say, have you guys not seen the Creekcraft item that was uploaded as UGC of his face, his literal face? Let, yo, let me see. Let me see if that's still, no, Creekcraft in the I avatar shop. Look at his Roblox avatar, bro. Like, look at this thing. Look at Baldcraft in the avatar shop. What the heck is it? Who made this, bro? It says this. This item is currently not for sale. I wonder why. That's weird. Maybe Creek hit them up or maybe they didn't want to get in trouble. I'm not sure. But look at this, bro. That means people are going to be able to make whatever they want and just throw it on the avatar shop. Like, this is wild. I would be pissed if I was Creek. This is just, this is ugly, bro. The Roblox avatar shop literally might change forever if they roll this out. This is going to be crazy. If anybody out there knows how to make UGC items, hit me up. You know what I'm saying? Get at me in the comments or hit me up on Twitter. Do something because I want to start making UGC. Why not?